You seriously beat Piers? Here's a TM to remember this moment. Sweet. Snarl. The user yells as if it's ranting about something, which lowers the special attack of the opposing Pokemon. Hey, there's some trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad even the champions come to sort things out. Oh, hey, you gave Piers a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over to the uh, there to help. Come on, then. I'll show you the way. I'm just going to be dragged along, aren't I? Oh, they're not even... Okay. Have a look around Spike Mouth and see what has to offer. I would love to do that. Kaboom. Hey, Leon. Roy K. Thanks for coming, but I got a handle on this. Whoever's making that noise, I'll see to it. I right, told you, Dana. Keep an eye on the goal. And for you, that's Wayne the Gym Challenge, mate. The only gym challenge left is the one you get from the Dragon's Gym Leader, Raihan, right? Raihan's the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. He's that good, you know. There I go again. Sorry, but I suppose it's no time for me to be stopping a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it. But don't you worry about a thing. The undefeatable champion is safe, is here to look after things, and I'll keep you all safe. Kaboom. The undefeatable champion needs to get his button moved in motion. They came from the tunnel, won't you say? Seems about to have a champion time. I'm amazed he found his way to the tunnel. All right, I want to see what the city has to offer. Because that was hinted at repeatedly. Hi. Huge, I'm a huge fan of Piers. I really fancy seeing him in more matches. At the end of the day, this place would be more lively if there are more gym challenges. Yeah, I admit that. Even a rundown place like this is important for people in Pokemon who live here. Alright, Noivern, you're amazing. Uh, however, I do believe it's time to upgrade your skills, my friend. Uh, remember a move. Noivern. He can learn some new stuff now. Uh, let's see. Not Moonlight. Not Absorb. Not Tackle. Not Gust. Not Supersonic. Not Whirlwind. Not Super Fang. Oh. Wait. There we go. This is the one I want. It's a... Yeah. So we're gonna get rid of the critical hit for air, uh, from Air Cutter with Air Slash. Uh, do I want the flinch or do I want the crit bonus? I guess I'll just keep it as is. I was planning on replacing it for acrobatics, but acrobatics doesn't seem to be something that I can use. So I guess we're going to hold off for now. What other Pokemon can use moves right now? Hulu, Totorage, Snom. And none of them at the moment. All right. All right. Uh, let's check out the rest of the town. Me? I'm just here as a part-time job. If I'm yelling in place for Parker Leaf staff. So like, are there stores here? Pokemon got to work hard for a gym trainer like me to do well. Cheers, mates. He defeated Piers. He's something. <coughs> it's kind of cool how like the whole country is kind of big on this sort of thing. They made it into an event, which I kind of appreciate. Hey. Look at that growl. So what are you guys up to? Closing the shutter sabotage the other challengers was the right poor sportsmanship. Speaking of peers, he refuses to Dynamax his Pokemon, but the chairman tried to move the gym to a kind of faraway place near a power spot. Oh, see? Some of the truth is coming to light here. I won't quit Team Yell. Keep cheering for Marine. For Marnie. Uh, Pokemon trade. How about your Obstagoon for my Konosi and Mr. Mime? Do I have an Obstagoon? I don't have one. Biz, we love Spark Mouth. Can I go talk to him? Love you. Send cheers to you. And I was just singing. All right. I thought there were stores back here. This looks storish, but I guess I can't go into anything. Okay. So it's not really a town. It's as much as it's like a extended hallway. Waste of time. Moving on.
<laughs> the whistle makes an echo effect in here. Making our way back. Hey guys. Sing, dance, let's make this party hall. If I dance, I shine, my Pokemon shines brighter too. Challenged by crew Owen and Andra. Ooh. Toxis, uh, Toxra City. Marcus, that's what the baby evolves into. All right, this is not an ideal combination. Um, Leech Life will be super effective against Maractus, but I don't really have something that works well on Toxicity. You know what, let's switch you out for uh, Toto Rage, because he, he at least has Dig. All right, Pikachu return. Noivern's gonna kind of wreck havoc. And he's the fastest Pokemon. Alright, let's try this. Uh, I think the wind attack actually hits both Pokemon. Yeah, Air Cutter hits both, right? And then you can use Dig on Toxus, uh, Toxra City. All right, you're down. Tower Rage is doing his thing. All right, Dragon Pulse. And then Tower Rage will finish him off. Nice. Good strategy there. Alright, Noivern, you're level 49. A little too powerful, actually. Pokemon and moves are mixed in, too. We'll have an amazing vibe. Dancing's the best way to stay healthy. That's true, actually. Alright, let's shake a tree. I need berries. Shake it some more. All right. Uh, I kind of want to put a new Pokemon in the party because I'm used to evolving them, right? But the problem is that I have all these Pokemon as a pretty nice setup right now. Feels like I could do better. Uh, I guess I'll just have Nine Tails up front. And then Pikachu can be second. And then Stom still needs to evolve before I can use him. What's this? The earth is shaking? Maybe if I try to sway in the same way. Nope, not helping. I hope everything's okay in Hammerlock. What's going on? What's with all the crazy shaking? Leon? Why is there a wild Dynamax Pokemon here? What is this red light? Ah, uh, something cool gonna happen when I walk through this bridge. Hey. Frikey! This is... mad, you know what I mean? Uh... Where's Leon? That's what I like to know! That noise was like some massive explosion! There's this huge surge of red light, and then wild Pokemon just start Dynamaxing around me, brazen as you like! Take a look at the news. See, there's Lee. He really is the greatest, right? All right, fanboy later. Leonis Charizard took down that Dynamax Pokemon in the blink of an eye. I knew Lee was strong, but this? Really makes you appreciate how great he is, yeah? Let's meet up with him, Raiki. He should be at Hammerlock Stadium. Oh, I've already caught most of the Pokemon in this list, so. Let's just speed along. 
Oh, hi. I acknowledge your strength. Please indulge me in a contest of strength and wits. You got it, Mr. Dapper. Gentleman Caden. Ooh. He sends out Dewblade. I got nine tails. And down you go. Ooh, speaking of which, it's daytime here, right? Does that mean it's gonna be daytime if I go to you know where? Uh, he sent out Passy Man. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a monkey. Uh, Inferno. Because I feel like it. Nope. Too agile, that monkey. <laughs> Alright, can we hit it proper? That's okay, it chose to power up. All right, your odds of hitting it are 50-50. Actually, it's a little higher because of the wide lens. There we go, now he's on fire. And he's burned, so he's not gonna hit me as hard. Although he did bulk himself up, so I suppose it makes up the difference. Actually, what am I doing? Isn't this a fighting type? Extra sensory. Yes, it is a fighting type, and I'm dumb. All right. So I got power-ups there. Next is about to send out Poltergeist, which sounds like a ghost type, which means I'm going to want someone who can use dark type moves. All right, uh, payback. And he's down! Ah, uh, see exactly as I thought. To live without making enemies, that's the way of a gentleman. Alrighty, let's see here. Who else is around? Ah, I've already been here. Okay, we've come full circle. Finally, we're back to the castle. Oy vey. And I wasted those potions, but oh well. Hey, how you doing? Now, there's only one thing left to do, and that is to see, because it's daytime here, I want to see if the day-night cycle is in real time, or if it's uh, partial time, like mo a lot of other games. Because it's partial time, I may be able to get Lucario right now, and then I'll have a new Pokemon to work with. Nope. Not happening. Alright. Back this way, then. Hey, right. over here! Well, if it isn't Raiki. I expect nothing less from you and your Charizard, Leon. You took down that Dynamax Pokemon in no time at all. Well, I am the unbeatable champ. Oh, uh. Well, I'm the unbeatable champion after all. Uh, hold on, Crikey. <laughs> but what's it all going Uh, but what all is going on here? An overflowing red light, Pokemon Dynamaxing without a power spot? Yeah, but why? I'm not sure. What's going on? That red light could suddenly appear again at any time and we have no way of knowing. 
Ah, but being able to predict such things is part of a scientist's work. Gran? The chairman called for me. You want to know all about the red light's relationship to the Dynamax phenomenon. Ah, uh, did the chairman know anything? Nothing worth my time. The chairman's all wrapped up fretting over the future of our energy, apparently. He's left everything to that executive lady. We just don't have enough data. That's why I want to ask you to start looking into things too, Sonya. You know more than anyone about the darkest day, after all. Are you saying the red light and the darkest day are connected? Hey, do you reckon there's anything we could do to help out? Yeah, there must be. Thanks. I appreciate the thought. But all I could ever ask of you would be that you join me in the greatest final match ever. I'll do my part to make that happen by keeping everybody's future safe. So you just keep on doing your part by winning your way through the gym challenge. Right, of course, you're the unbeatable champion after all, eh? I think he's gonna find out he's not so unbeatable. Gran, there's something I want to look into. You'll help me, right? Naturally. Looks like we all know what we need to do. So, you two clear the gym challenge so we can meet again at the Champion Cup. I know what I need to do, all right. Defeat the peers once and defeat that peers once and for all. You have to Hammerlock Stadium, yeah, Raki? Raihan's a tough nut to crack. Oh, he still have to take on peers. So he's behind me, he weighs. And we have our own challenge to take on, don't we? Uh, but we're gonna do that in the next episode. I don't want to extend this into like. I think the third 35 minute video in a row. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and we'll see you all in the next episode where we take on the final gym challenge. Bye.